and then they've got rock stars coming off the yeah. bench. I hate to keep making the music analogy, but it is. It's like they've got the Beatles in the starting lineup. Or even when a player goes in and makes a mistake, is it a, is it a quick hook with the pressure of a final? Patient here. For, there's a double team in the low post. Teodosic lets fly, and that three is good. The three-point shot is dropping for Teodosic. Now he's got the ball in his hands, and his pass almost intercepted oh. by Andrew Andrews, and it just hell, falls into the lap. Bits of probes. Kicks to the corner. Dudzinski, shot clock running down. Nice pass to Hayes. But Hayes just can't get the shot off. Back to Weems in the low post. He'll skip a pass to Teodosic, who rises. And Teodosic is money. Teodosic, let's fly. Teodosic is feeling it. Detroit goal from Milos Teodosic. Out of their passing game. Slick passing here from Bologna. They find Bellinelli, and Bellinelli does what he does best. He knocks down a triple. The pass right down to JT, who lays it up and in. And you start to wonder now. Bologna have got one hand on the trophy. Andrews, his shot blocked by Kyle Weems. Pass ahead. Andrews, oh. the block from none other than Kyle Weems, who's been Superman tonight. Club founded back in 2014. Look at Taya Dosic, what it means to him. It's a Euro Cup championship. It's a ticket to the Euro League. Yeah, they return back to the Euro League. They haven't been in the Euro League since 2007, 2008 season. And so Bologna will ink their name in the 2022 Euro Cup. As the champions wrap this one up with some awards, Theodosic putting in a claim to be tonight's MVP of the game. This is what it's about. I got my kids, my wife, my family back home is watching. But this is for the city of Bologna. Thank you so much. Congrats. Forza! Well, Theodosic will add the MVP, finals MVP, to what has been a remarkable career. Looks like Bellinelli is going to get the first touch. And fitting because Bellinelli, of course, hails from Bologna originally. And he gets to raise the 20th edition of the Seven Days Euro Cup, the 2022 champions, Virtus Bologna.